Bulldog's Relation Report. Now you can see Pen Kusuna. Kusuna. Now you can see Pen Kusuna to the Hotel Parliament for the sparkling wine. Hanky shake it right. See us, Doc. Laura, how you? Tom, how are you? Ash. Bulldog. Bulldog. Is that a real song? I don't know if this is the real song, you guys tell me in the comments. Oh, Alright, so first we checked into Hotel Parliament and we really liked it. It's really central, it's right by the Parliament. Yeah, we had the suite and it was absolutely massive, really comfortable. And it's really exciting, it actually has its own separate entrance. So first things first, this is the living space and television number edge. We were really impressed to see that they have a kitchen. They've got pans, they've got pots, they've got everything you need. So there's also a really sweet card. Dear Laura and Tambo, it is our greatest pleasure to welcome you for your stay in Budapest. And there's some fruit. Okay, so this is really cool. Check this out. It's a walk-in closet. This is where you'll be sleeping. Follow me. So this is the bathroom. We don't normally show you the bathroom because that's kind of weird, but this one is special because not only does it have a bath, it has a bath with feet. I really like these. My grandpa used to have these when I was um, like a kid. He had a bathtub with feet on. It doesn't just have a bath, it also has a massive shower and a sink each. And last but certainly not least is the bedroom and TV number Kato. They also gave you a special present, didn't they? Yeah, they did. They gave me some wine for my birthday, which was a really nice touch. I think any time a hotel celebrates your birthday with you, it's really nice. I think they should all do that. Okay, so then we went from the hotel to the actual parliament building and took some Insta good photos. We are taking some Instagram photos now. Over there are some guards in front of the parliament building. People are taking photos. Are they like the British guards and they're not allowed to move? Good question, I don't know. Anyways, Let show us. Know. And we also discussed the present that I got you. Tell us about the present. It's like a Fitbit and it tells you the time and how many steps you've done and the meters. So how many steps have you done so far? Saz Hat Van Kato. Yeah, so that was really nice and we took some photos. It was a really beautiful day. Tamo took some really nice photos. That was like also part of my birthday treat because normally I'm like, Tamo, take loads of photos of me. And he's like, no, but it was my birthday, so he had to. And it was a beautiful day in Budapest, so. All right, we took some Insta good photos of Laura and the Parliament House on her birthday. Yeah. Now we're off to get some lunch. Napfanyesh Eteran. I love it so much I can pronounce it greatly. <laughs> Alright, this is the birthday cheers for the birthday girl. Thank you, Shigatre. Thank you, Shigatre. That's really good. But, um, I mean, this is a vegan restaurant. The food is absolutely delicious. I had a Hungarian meal. It's um, like stuffed cabbages. I've forgotten the name of it, but it's really, really good. I really like it. And I had it last year and I was like, oh, I don't know if I'll have the same thing this time. Um, maybe it's not as good as I remember. It was better than I remember. It, was so, so, I... it looked better as well because it, yeah. this is what it looked like last year. And this is what it looked like this year. What did you have? So I had a gigantic pizza. God. So Laura wanted me to order this extra cheese thing and thankfully I didn't, that's just her, so... And what's more, the staff are really nice there, so yeah. it's kind of like a stereotype of hungry that the staff in restaurants and cafes are a little bit grumpy. Sometimes we'll go in there and be like, oh, can I have this? And I'll be like... <laughs> and it's fair enough because like not just hungry like any country. Yeah, yeah, yeah a lot of a lot of European countries are like this. Yeah. But in that Fenis Italy and they're all really happy and they're really lovely and like we tried to order in Hungarian and they were really supportive of it and they were like, oh Nagyon yo. Later on she's like, oh phenom and, and I was like, yeah, phenom and she was really nice, the woman uh, our pincer no. <laughs> I also bought a cake there, or should I say a torta. <laughs> So if you haven't been there yet, we really recommend you do go there. We're not affiliated with them at all, but they would like to give us lots of food every day. That would be awesome. <laughs> all right, that was our lunch. What do you think? Oh, nice. Anyway, so then we went to Anka, which is a ruined bar. We'd never been there before, but our friend Kata recommended it. Thank you so much. It was a really cool bar. We really liked it. Um, we met up with some people. It was so cool. So um, we asked some of our favorite Maggie Weasels and we asked some bloggers to meet up with us. So it was a nice like mixture of... Yeah, fans and friends and fans new and people. Friends. And new people. Canadians, Irish people, Hungarians, Germans, Brit. 
Yeah, baby! <laughs> yeah. Massive special thanks to Kata for this awesome present. Check this out. How beautiful is that? Like, Tambo got me this present. My mum got me actually some really nice presents. But mostly, apart from my mum and Tambo, nobody gets me presents anymore because, well, they like to say it's because I'm abroad and they can't find me, but really they're just Back to Kata, I wasn't expecting a present. Kata gave me a present, it was so lovely of her, I was so touched. Let's see what she got me. Mm. So as you all know, I love wine and I love Hungarian wine. And this is both wine that is Hungarian. This is Hungarian wine. Oh my God, anyway. She got you a present. She yeah, you a present. Yeah, I know, this is so thoughtful. There you go. And she got me some awesome Yumolch. Some fruit, fruit and wine. Thank you so much for coming. It was really great to see you. And we met her best friend who's also really lovely. She has the cutest pug. Oh my God, I love pugs. So the other day we went to um, an animal rights protest in Budapest. It was really great. We met some other vegans, that was really nice. But we also saw one of our other super fans, Kinga, who gave me this birthday present. How gorgeous is this? <laughs> Ah, Kusunum Kinga. So special thanks to Kinga as well. Uh, who else do we see? So we saw my friend Janet. Well, our friend Janet even. There you go. So our friend Janet was there. Thank you so much. Thank you for the beers. And also a massive thank you to Chandra as well for the drinks. She was so lovely. She bought everyone drinks, which was so nice. Yeah. And thank you to the other Kata for coming as well. Kata has the nicest hair. Mm. And um, she brought her boyfriend Pete, who is also really lovely. And the dog, oh my god. But it didn't end there. Tell us what we also did the next day. Well, the next day we were very hungover. Yeah, actually the day after that day. <laughs> the day after that day, we met up with our friend Janet again. And we went on the hop on, hop off tour. Mm. It's the one with the giraffe. So there are a few different hop on, hop off tours in Budapest. We think this is definitely the best one. It's really cool. It also includes a river cruise, uh, which we also went on. A night bus and yeah, so we also went on the ferry. True. I think my favorite view of my favorite building, the Hungarian parliament, is like from the river because it's really nice to get it with the- Yeah, from the front. Yeah. So yeah, we really recommend you do that. It was really good because I think Budapest is fun to walk around because it's very flat, but it's really tiring. So if you're not here for that long, definitely go on this bus. And special thanks to Katja who got us the tickets. Yeah, thank you, Katja. <laughs> And last but not least, I went to one of the thermal baths in Budapest with Janet. We went to the Gellert ones, and that's my favorite one that I've been to so far. And it was awesome, of course. So again, thank you so much to everyone that was involved in my birthday. Yeah. And thank you for all of you for watching this video. Kissing your kamek takim tish. If you're new to this channel, subscribe. Join us on Facebook. We have a group called the Muck Your Weasels. And we invite you. We're inviting you indeed. And that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you soon. See ya, Stark!